What's up guys, Awesome Nerd Show here and today we're with our second part of our Black Friday Hall of Pops and this time we got the Star Wars Rebels Pop. So I think this is um, just about it. We have one left that I know of um, and I'm just waiting for a different version of it and stuff um, but we'll go ahead and go through it. So first up we have is um, the Kanan or Kanan, I don't know exactly how you say his name and stuff um, but so of course he is the leader of the Rebels, the uh, Jedi of the group and so um, all these pops look super cool, but I do have a problem, especially with this cannon, is that his lightsaber is a little bent. I don't know why it's like that, but I have checked out a couple more since I got this one, and they are all bent like that. I don't know if it's just the places I shop at get bad shipments or what, but they're all like bent and curved like that. But anyway, he looks really cool. Of course, he's got all his like armor, especially on his arm and stuff there, and he's got a gun um, on his side over here he's got his pon hair and a ponytail and stuff and it just looks super cool just he's got that curved lightsaber I don't know why and of course this is the Star Wars one so they all have this base but the weird thing is is um, this one sits um, the base sits sideways in the box like it's made like that like it's turned to the side where usually they're normally straight on like that and the characters turn but the base is now turned in Kanan's uh, face on so that's the first one that was 132 and 133 is it says chop but i'm pretty sure they call him chopper in the show and he's the little r2 character that's really funny so I can get him out of here and again i don't know why the box calls him chopper it could like obviously be his real name or something um but they just don't call him that so there he is in all his coolness and his weird bobble Headiness, just like the R2 it's in his legs I don't know if you can see that and stuff and then like he can kind of move up and down and stuff and rock back and forth and everything but he's got his two little hands up in the air like he <laughs> likes to um, grab stuff with him just like move around and wave him and stuff like that and make a lot of noise and stuff he's such a cool character but so that is Chopper or as the box says Chop so there's that one then 134 is of course the star of the show of Ezra which um, I really like this pop. I looked at it already, and it's really nice. So I'll get it out of here. Okay. And again, very similar to um, the uh, Kanan. His lightsaber is kind of like bent and curved too, but this one for sure is due to the um, the like pop box here. It's, I don't know, it's gonna be hard to see, but like this is all like curved, and so his lightsaber sits in there, and it's got uh, bent because of it and he has a special lightsaber that also doubles as a gun in the show and stuff which is really cool but what I really like about him is his hair how he is like it's supposed to be like or I don't know it's supposed to be but in the show I always thought he had like black hair and stuff but this it's like a weird bluish car of course with the light it makes it super bright but just when you look at it, it looks like it could be black but then it's um like a it's got like a dark blue or navy blue or something like that but then he's got his like very similar <laughs> looking rebels outfit like uh, the X-Wing pilot and stuff and it just looks awesome and of course he's got his hand out like he's using the force or something and so that is really cool next up is Hera which of course is the Twi'lek of the group and she's the pilot so you get this. Oh, her, she came off her base oh, she's stuck in there so she has, of course, the giant tentacles on the back of her head, which makes her super top-heavy. But she's got her goggles, and then she has a little gun in her hand, and she's in um, an outfit similar to Ezra's and stuff. It looks like the um, X-Wing pilots from the old Star Wars and stuff. And she just looks really cool. And of course, like I said, she's the pilot, and she's like a mechanic and all that sort of stuff. And it just um, reminds me a lot of... Uh, the girl, I forget what her name is, but a girl from uh, Firefly. That's what the show reminds me of a lot. It's like a cartoon version of Firefly. <laughs> but there is her, and of course her base is just in the box. It, she came off of it. And then the last one I have here is Zeb, which is like the Chewbacca character in the show. He's like the big hairy creature that's second in, second command or whatever is what I call him, to Kanan. So he, I don't know what kind of creature he is, but he looks really cool. He's got his bright green eyes, 
his like beard type thing and stuff and designs all over his head and pointy ears. Then he's got his weird looks like homemade gun almost. I don't know what it is, but it looks it's all got like tape or rope holding it together and stuff. Then he's in um an outfit with all sorts of armor and stuff on it. Then his bare feet, his three toes, four toes, I guess it is. It just looks really cool. So that's a really nice um, looking design on him. So the only other character that I don't have yet is the Sabine. And I'm waiting for the Walgreens exclusive. And if you know Pops and Walgreens, it's going to be a while. Unless you ordered it online or something like that. Um, so that is all the Star Wars Rebels Pops. But I do have one last thing. And that was, I did get the gold BB-8 in a dome. I was really surprised that I was even able to get this because I went to Hot Topic and they had it in store. They actually had probably about 20 of them left, so I was able to actually get it. I thought it was a lost cause for me because I kept checking their website and they never had it in, like it was never in stock. And I missed the first time it went in, um, was in stock and you could order it. I missed that and everything. So I thought he would be a long lost thing that I would never get and stuff. But it looks super cool. So it's just like the normal BB-8 pop. But it's just all, I don't know if it's painted uh, cr the chrome or uh, metal or can't think of it. Gold is what I'm trying to say. Um, I don't know if it's painted or it was just made out of that material and stuff. But it's all solid. And he has a bobble head so you can kind of see it um, shaking in there. But his head's really high up off his body and I don't like that. You can um, take off the dome and get in there but it's... Um, like he doesn't feel very he doesn't feel like normal material and stuff so i'm afraid i'm gonna break if i do anything to it but as you can see on the bottom of the base there it says star wars then on the back side it says pop has a little um, pop logo and stuff so it's just really cool being in this nice display dome case and stuff so that's just really awesome and this thing is just so cool i love bb8 now having this um ultimate like collector's item kind of thing is really cool so that's going to be it for this um, Star Wars Funko um, revealing, unboxing, I don't know whatever you call it. But it's the black my Black Friday haul of Star Wars pops and stuff. So that's going to be it. Be sure to hit that thumbs up if you enjoyed. Leave any comments you have down below and hit that red subscribe button to check out all our unboxings. And we will see you next time.